Vote by mail is underway. So far, about 10% of Californians have returned their mail-in ballots. CBS 13's Chante Passmore is digging deeper into this issue and has a closer look at how one group is trying to get more people to cast their ballot. The percentage of vote by mail ballots returned is barely in the double digits, but political onlookers say it's still too early to call turnout anemic. The question for some, will this primary turnout be higher than historic primaries as Californians struggle to make ends meet? The June 7 primary is underway, but election season is far from some people's priorities. Instead, their minds are preoccupied on gas. It would certainly be inflation. Definitely the gun violence. But only two of the three Californians you heard from say they plan to vote in the primary. Out of the nearly 22 million voting ballots sent to homes, a little more than 2 million have been returned so far. In 2018, primary turnout was 28%. 37% in 2020. Can I tell you, don't despair. The League of Women Voters of California. People do not hone in on elections until like Friday, Saturday, Sunday before actual election day. The voting rights group is offering voters information featured in multiple languages while explaining office positions, who's financing campaigns, and how to return mail-in ballots. Recent headlines of overturning Roe v. Wade and mass shootings saw people gather at rallies and vigils. But will that energy transfer into a vote? I do think, though, that everything that's going on in our country will bring some, maybe some additional people to the fold. In some cases, first time voters emerge. After the last election, I just uh, didn't really like the results and I felt like my voice, I didn't let my voice be heard.